Jurassic Heart. Sometimes love is just more than a species. Ooh, kinky. No, I'm kidding. Hi, welcome to Jurassic Heart. We can enter our name. It's a love dating sim between two lovers, two romance, two people of extreme persuasion and passion. My name, I'm Anthony, and I am about to engage in a loving relationship. Oh, hello. The music is so sentimental. It feels as if I'm really about to engage in a loving relationship with someone. All right, it's time to go buy ukulele with Tara Coon. Yeah, maybe I should buy him a meal too. I'm the reason why his old one broke after all. <laughs> Don't be so silly, Anthony. You didn't break the dinosaur's ukulele. How is he supposed to play a ukulele anyway? He's got small arms. Actually, that's the instrument he can play because of his small arms. A small instrument. And we can get him a harmonica as well, but I don't think we'd reach to his snout or mouth. Dinosaurs have snouts. Yeah, we should continue. Come to think of it, isn't this going to be the first time I meet him outside of school? Well, this is going to be awkward. I mean, meeting a dinosaur outside of school, that's not too safe. You know, my mother always said, be careful, especially when you're going out with predators, like the Tyrannosaurus Rex. That makes me nervous, but he makes sure I don't look funny. Let's see, which hair, hair, hair clip should I go for? Wait, I'm a chick? No, I need my character. Oh, damn it. I'm a, I'm a dude. I swear to you, I'm a dude. I'm manly. I have I have a penis. It's pretty manly. I thought it, I thought it was satisfying the T-Rex's needs, but apparently I'm a girl. It's a guy T-Rex. What if I'm a guy and it's a guy T-Rex? Would that be bestiality? Would it be fossilality? It'd probably be fossilality. It'd probably be weird. Oh my god, I don't even want to think about it. Yeah. Well, I, I think I should go for the meat on the bone shaped hair clip. You know, appease the dinosaur. He, like, he likes meat. I like meat. Yeah, I think this one's pretty cute and, and kind of manly. It looks yummy too. Oh god, I'm losing my man card before I even got it. A prehistoric man card. Hopefully Tierra Coon will like the meat, like I do. Like meat, like- I'm not gay! All set. Now I better hurry and go meet him at the station. Yeah, it's gonna be so much fun. I can't wait. Oh, I don't even know how to read that at all. Um, oh, there he is! It's like an inner, you know, soliloquy, inner, inner monologue, inner dialogue in my own head. They can hear me. Uh, hello, hello, Tierra Coon. D did I make you wait? <laughs> oh my god, he's so big! He's gonna ravage my body. Ah! Uh, not at all, Anthony! I just got here as well. I don't know what kind of voice to give a Tyrannosaurus Rex. I'd be like, ah, like, a, like, a, like an elephant train noise. But how do you even fit in the train station? He's rather large. I'm not making fun of him. I'm just saying, oh, he's got a cool tie. Good thing we're best buds. Uh, by the way, that hair clip. Oh, oh, this? I thought it'd be a good idea to wear something different once in a while. You know, I'd like to spice up the life. You know, before we all get crushed by meteors and die. That is, unless you want to get crushed by meteors and die, if you're into that kind of thing. By all means, I love getting crushed by meteors and dying. It's, 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 it's kinky. No, it's, I mean, it's, I, hi. yeah, hi, hi. And, and, and my favorite food is meat, so, you know, it was a perfect fit. Oh, really? I like meat, too. Oh, that, that's good. I'm, I'm glad you're, you're a carnivore. Well, I mean, I'm not trying to insult you and your people, but you did rip apart animals to shreds. You know, it happens. Well, I, I didn't know that. Maybe we could have some grilled, grilled chicken. Are you trying to chase me, Anthony? You're in a long-loving relationship, and you're offering the man grilled chicken? I mean, it's a girl dinosaur. It's, it's, a, it's a girl di dinosaur. Um, how about we give it some substance, like horse? We're going to have horse meat. Uh, although, I'm pretty sure that's where people got in trouble for that. Cows. We're going to kill cows. Chicken? Chicken's like a pussy meal. It's so small. I mean, I love chicken. Actually, chicken's not really meal I eat. But I love... I love something more. I need substance like steak. Steak would be good. That doesn't sound bad, actually. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad, Mr. Dinosaurus Rex. I didn't mean to push you away. I'm here for a loving relationship. I don't mean to, I don't mean to destroy what we have. Looks like it's going well. Oh, man. I, I've never really had like, a kiss before, especially from this kind of guy, like an older guy. You know, an older T-Rex kind of mammal thingy. So, are you ready to go get your new ukulele? Yes, let's go. Oh, uh, where? Uh, do I hawk him? Do I put him on a leash? Do I not put him on a leash? Should we just look at the screen? I mean, I feel like you kind of need like a leash or a muzzle. How did we fit in the door? Uh, all right, let's get you a nice ukulele. Wow, you really are fired up about this, aren't you? Tiara Coon, I'm the one who put you in this situation with the music club. Of course I feel bad. I didn't mean 
to break it. It's just that when I sat down, I didn't realize I was gaining weight, and I didn't realize my butt broke it. But I'm here to make things better for you, okay, Tierra Coon? So choose whatever you like. It's on me. I, I think we're being a little forceful, okay? I think kind of if, if we're, we're supposed to, like, when you break something of someone else's, yeah, you're supposed to replace it. I agree with that. But you're kind of pushing the front too much because you like him, Anthony. You love him. You want to have sex with the dinosaur. And you want to have little dinosaur babies, don't you, Anthony? I mean, this is me. Why am I, why am I arguing with myself? Yeah, about that. I, I know how you feel, but I want you to know that it wasn't your fault. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. You didn't know that I'd panic in front of people. I did, and dropped my old ukulele, breaking it into pieces as a result. He's so... He's so sad. I, we should probably pet him. Which wouldn't have happened if I didn't force you to play in front of them. I didn't know you got awkward in front of people. Peer pressure is not good. I'm sorry. Sometimes I get awkward in front of people. Like if I'm peeing and there's people around, I get really awkward. And sometimes I just spray them with the pee. It's an awkward situation. But, but you didn't. If I chose to do it myself, if you were forcing me, I wouldn't be here. Except he's kind of... He could eat me. Look, I have a secret, Tierra. I'm here more than just... I'm here to be more than just a person that's buying you a ukulele. I want to buy your love, too. Really, I'd feel terrible if you had to pay for something I did. So, just let me pay for it, okay? No. No. Tori tells him says, but he sounds really upset. A about what? About being a dinosaur? I'd be upset if I was a dinosaur, too. I'm fucking extinct. What should I do? Well, I can insist on paying. I can insist to pay for half the price. I can give up and let him pay. No. No, 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 no. I... Uh, it was my fault. I am I am the caretaker in this relationship and I will I will satisfy his needs through monetary denominations. Insist on paying. I insist. I brought the situation up, which cost you your music instrument. I'll pay for it. End of discussion. I don't think being so forceful that dinosaur is a good idea again. Da 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 I'm, I did I upset you? I didn't I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to. You know, maybe I don't need this after all. That that Tierra? Tierra? What, what what do you mean? I need, I need, I'm going home! Goodbye! Ah! That was a chicken squawk. Oh, God. At least he didn't eat me. Wait, wait, Tierra Coon! He's gone. Wait, it is a he. Oh, crap. We're having gay dinosaur sex. I don't understand. I was being nice. Why would he do that to me? Maybe I came off too strong. You're damn right you came off too strong. No, you should not call him and apologize later. You should give it five days before you call. Although he may be having sex with a, uh, like a, a long neck. I forgot. Or a triceratops. Yeah. Yeah, they're really horny. <laughs> <laughs> Dinosaur <puns. laughs> Ter Terrible end! No, good- oh, okay. We should try that again.